Hey everybody, Josh here from Shama. And today on Run With Us, we're playing disc golf. There'll be very, in fact, there'll be no running, but uh, there'll be much disking and golfing. So I got my brother Willie here and Keith. Keith's actually a new uh, hire at Shama. He's been doing a bunch of work, making the whole process more streamlined and more, making us more productive. So, uh, and we're also testing out some new sandals today. Uh, these ones have, tons of grip we don't really have a name for it yet we're working on some stuff but this is coming out really soon and uh, this is they're perfect for any kind of hiking or active sport like this where you need tons of grip so uh, we're gonna get to it play some disc <laughs> All right, here we are at De La Viega Park. This is like the epicenter of disc golf. Uh, I think it's one of the one of the earliest courses and still one of the best. Anyways, I lost my disc here, uh, a Star Destroyer recently, and I bought a new one. I just wanna show you, isn't that rad artwork? I love this thing. So part of the deal here in Santa Cruz is that in the summertime, it's actually really foggy in the morning and the evening. And then by the time halfway through September and maybe like in October, that's actually the best weather of the year in this part of California, all the way up to San Francisco and stuff like that. We get sunny, clear days and it's a little crisper because the marine layer isn't as bad. I don't know what's going on. Our marine layer is going nuts. We just it's almost raining out here. You can hear uh, dew dropping off the trees because the fog is so thick. It's been like this for a week and a half now. I don't know what's up, uh, but I'm not excited because at Shama, I want to project warmth and summer emotions for the sandals, but it's just not happening. But we're having fun anyway. First good uh, approach shot or any shot I've had today. Easy part. So, uh, the thing about the La Viega is that if there's one feature to it, it's that it's unrelenting. There's never a let up. Each hole, it seems like, could be maybe the hardest hole in a lot of other courses. And I spoke with my brother-in-law recently. He came down here and he's, he's super nuts about disc golf right now. And so we were playing and he's just like, but then there's, you know, hole three, hole four, it doesn't matter. Each one is just, so challenging. So here we are, we gotta go over this rise. You can't see the backside. And if you make it through this little clearing, now you've gotta go another like 200 feet through all this little maze of trees downhill. And your disc is probably gonna end up off to the side or something like that, down a, down a ravine. Anyways, we're gonna spot for Willie right now. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Almost bounced out. <laughs> it's just like the edge. Yeah. Alright Josh, no pressure. No pressure, no camera. No. Hey Josh, what's what's uh what's happening? Oh nothing. I just thought I'd pick up a big heavy stick and throw it at this tree here. <laughs> just for fun. Alright, now I still gotta throw it across here.
Watch your face, Roy. Oh. I got through. Press it. Did you get it, bro? So here we are at Top of the World. It's a pretty famous disc golf hole here at uh, De La Viega Park. And uh, it's been fun so far. We've been having a good time. We haven't thrown our best. There's some good, some bad, and some really ugly. But the main thing is we're hanging out together and having fun. where Slender Man lives. <laughs> wow. I don't even need to tell you what that smells like. <sighs> it's great. Pretty foul in there. No thanks. Let's go back to disc golf. All right, so here we are. We played probably 10 holes. We didn't play that many, but just, we gotta get back to work. We gotta make your sandals. <laughs> and so, <laughs> dang it. <laughs> but we had fun. How'd you guys like your sandals? Oh, they're awesome. Super yeah. grippy, super solid platform. Yep. Love it. Especially on the hills. Yeah. Very sure-footed, for sure, in them. Very sure-footed. Almost like a what, really? I, I don't know. I couldn't place it. <laughs> Maybe like a mountain goat? Yeah. Uh, Even different. else. Even more sure-footed. Even sure -footed. more sure-footed than a mountain goat. Anyways, we're going to figure out a name for them. We hope you had a good time. We had a lot of fun just hanging out. And we'll see you next time on Run With Us, when we'll probably be running. Happy trails. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, yes. Don't record that. <laughs>